Hollywood, the standards of beauty are completely different from what we are taught as daughters of God. Um, we would sit in the hair and makeup chair for up to two hours. And we would come in with no makeup on, our hair not done. And we would sit in the hair and makeup chair, and we would get a base, and we would get powder, and we would get bronzer, and we'd get fake eyelashes, and we'd get eyeshadow, we'd get liner, we'd get lipstick, we'd have teeth whitening, we'd get extensions in our hair, we'd be made to enhance to look more womanly, if you know what I mean. And we honestly would go in looking one way and come out looking like Hollywood stars the world's definition maybe of what beauty is. I started thinking about what true beauty meant to me and how I feel when I'm all made up and all done up and, and I feel pretty. But I started thinking about, do I really feel more beautiful? And as John, by the way, said, there's a light in your eyes when you live the gospel of the church and, and when you live the standards of the church that can't be taken away when you take off your makeup. And for me, feeling beautiful means living the way my Heavenly Father would want me to live. These eyelashes that I put on this morning make me feel pretty, but they don't make me beautiful. This eyeshadow that I put on today took about, I don't know, maybe 10 or 15 minutes to put on each eye. Make me feel pretty. Now I'm going to look like a zombie and be really pretty. It's okay, it's Halloween. <laughs> but don't make me beautiful. This lipstick is one of my favorite colors. Okay, thanks, girls. So that took me all of about, what, 20 seconds to take off my makeup. What took me, you know, 30 minutes or so to put on. And I'm still Carmen. I'm still who I am. What makes you beautiful is who you are inside. Your, your countenance is what radiates through your eyes, and that can't be taken off with makeup. So I would encourage each one of you girls, I'm not saying you have to go out without makeup every day or dress like a bag lady or not shower. Well, Carmen said you don't have to to be pretty. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying on think about what you're spending your time focusing on and what your definition of being beautiful means to you. And I'm gonna sing one of my very favorite songs um, called Beautiful to Him. And if any of you girls know this song, I want you to sing it along with me. peace destroy I can hardly hear the voice leading me through the void so much noise the world's little lies destruction in disguise opportunities to compromise to make me beautiful in their I'm not gonna buy the world's little lies Cause I define myself and find my beauty in the light he gives I'm refined by his divine intentions every day I live It doesn't matter what the world believes Or what they say that beauty means It comes from within I wanna be beautiful. 